Hello everybody, this is Vial and I am back with another video for you guys today. More awkward rambling from me, but today is another book review. Yay! Anyways, this book review video is going to be um, something different. It is going to be on a Filipino novel from the Philippines. A little bit proud of it because it's from my heritage, from my hometown, my homeland. And this is going to be a review on this book called Para Kai B. This is a book by Ricky Lee. Um, o, pa, o kung paano din devastate ng pag-ibig ang um, 4 out of 5 sa atin. I'm going to translate all of that for you guys who are not uh, native language speakers of Tagalog. Um, pretty much roughly translate. I apologize. Uh, rough translation, but it rough translation is <laughs> um, 4B and how love devastated 4 out of 5 of us and again this is a novel by Ricky Lee um, before I go on under review I wanted to read off a quote that's on this book on this novel and it said may kota ang pag-ibig sa bawat limang umiibig ay isa lang ang magiging maligaya kasama ka ba sa kota so Rough translation again. Um, it said, "Love has a quota. For every five per, uh, five people who fall in love, only one person's gonna find happiness." Do you think you're part of that quota? So I thought that was really thought provoking. This is a series of stories that are interconnected. Ricky Lee, actually, a little bit of a background is a filmmaker, screenwriter, so it kind of follows that format. This is a very short novel. It actually um, has a really nice pretty cover for a novel that came from the Philippines. Um, it's This edition is by the Writer Studio, so um, it looks really pretty. The cover art is gorgeous. and It's this um, nice type of paperback to have this flip, more harder bound covered. Gorgeous in the back too. Um, so on to the book, a series of love stories about different kinds of love, familial love, unrequited love, lost love, uh, love between friends, between enemies, um, pretty much a formidable and vulnerable look into an intimately fascinating and riveting um, facet of love. It is definitely crafted by someone who enjoys screenwriting and writing about love stories and romantic comedies and it's definitely um it's meant to mesmerize you when you're reading this book because you just feel so connected to these stories and you feel like it's so relatable um gave this book four out of five just because um i had actually okay to be honest i had a hard time going through this novel just because there's a lot of like more modern Filipino slang that's like Taglish, half Tagalog and half English and I left the Philippines when I was 14 and sometimes some of the words um, I don't really necessarily get the slang but very enjoyable novel do pick it up if you know somebody in the Philippines or somebody can buy it for you and again you know it's a very 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 good read um and very short read too you're just gonna enjoy yourself while you're reading it uh fair warning though the whole text is in tagalog or filipino so if you're not a native speaker it might be really hard it was definitely hard for me because of the slang but it's definitely worth picking up so that's my review see you guys later bye